हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ड्यूडियर अकेडमी वी आर डिस्कसिंग द मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चंस ऑफ वेरियस कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जामिनेशंस दैट इज डील विद द एनाटॉमी एंड फिजियोलॉजी ऑफ मस्कुलर स्केलेटल सिस्टम डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब द चैनल एंड आल्सो शेयर टू योर फ्रेंड्स क्वेश्चन नंबर 1 द टोटल नंबर ऑफ बोन्स इन ह्यूमन स्कल ऑप्शंस 20 bonds 22 bonds 24 bonds 12 bonds answer 22 bonds the human skull is generally considered to consist of 22 bonds that is 8 cranial bonds and 14 facial bonds question number 2 the number of cranial bonds are options 6 bonds 7 bonds 8 bonds 9 bonds answer eight bonds that include one frontal bone two parietal bones two temporal bones one occipital bone one sphenoid bone and one ethmoid bone so total eight cranial bones question number 3 dash is not a facial bone options maxilla zygomatic bone vomer sphenoid bone answer sphenoid bone sphenoid bone is not a facial bone it is a cranial bone facial skeleton consists of two nasal bones two lacrimal bones two inferior nasal concha two maxilla one mandible one vomer two zygomatic bones and two palatine bones question number 4 The basic unit of compact bone is options trabecular osteon osteoblast chondrocytes answer osteon most bones contains compact and spongy osseous tissue and the compact bone is denser and stronger and can withstand the compressive forces and the basic structural unit of the compact bone is called as osteon or haversian system question number 5 dash is a u shaped bone that does not articulate with any other bone options hyoid bone sphenoid bone ethmoid bone bone answer hyoid bone hyoid bone or we call it as tongue bone is a horse shoe shaped bone situated in the anterior midline of the neck between the chin and the thyroid cartilage and the unique feature of this hyoid bone is that it is the only bone in the body that is not attached to another bone that is it floats freely in the neck okay Next is question number six. The shoulder blade bone is called options vertebra, incus, scapula, carpal. Answer scapula. So scapula is a flat triangular bone located at the back of the trunk. which serves as a site for attachment of many muscles question number 7 the bottom portion of the sternum is called options manubrium siphoid process incus carpal answer siphoid process siphoid process is a cartilaginous section at the lower end of the sternum which is not attached to any ribs it functions as a vital attachment point for several major muscles like the diaphragm okay so answer is siphoid process question number 8 what is the another name for toes options carpals antecubitals manubriums phalanges answer is Phalanges. Question number nine, which is not a part of appendicular skeleton. 
options limbs shoulders ribs hips answer ribs skeleton is divided into two major parts axial skeleton which include skull spine and rib cage and the appendicular skeleton which include the appendages that attach them to the axial skeleton appendicular skeleton is consisting of shoulder girdles arms and forearms hands pelvis thighs and legs feet and ankles so the answer is ribs question number 10 metacarpal bones are found in options leg skull hip hand answer hand metacarpal bones form the intermediate part of the hand thank you don't forget to like comment and subscribe our channel and also share to your friends